A new feature in Raw Power 3.0 is the LUT adjustment. LUT stands for lookup table, which is a technical term for a large table of numbers that describe how to convert every possible color in an image. A lookup table can tint, make an image black and white, or make very significant changes to an image's appearance. LUTs are popular for two reasons. First, they make it really easy to apply a look to a set of images, as is typically done in movies for example, in color grading. Secondly, because a LUT is a single adjustment, it can be combined with a preset or other adjustments. And they're really quick to apply and try out. Raw Power ships with a bunch of LUTs and it's possible to add additional ones. If you search the internet for LUTs, you can find a number of companies that provide LUTs for free or for purchase. I recommend the company LUTify.me which has provided raw power with a number of expertly designed LUTs. The LUT adjustment in raw power is very easy to use. You use the pop-up menu to choose a LUT. You can see the first section are the LUTs I've installed myself, and then the built-in LUTs. There are three categories, creative, film simulations, and the ones from LUTify.me. Film simulations are designed to be similar, but not identical, to some analog films. Also, note that these simulations only include color. They don't contain grain or vignetting. As you roll over the LUTs, the image changes immediately. The bleach bypass makes a significant bleaching effect to an image. I'll pick that one by clicking on it. There's an intensity slider that you can use to dial down the effect. In addition, built-in LUTs include a series of desaturating ones, ones that change the image to monochrome, and many more. If I move the mouse off of the pop-up, you will see it goes back to the image without the LUT applied, so it's very easy to see the image before and after. Here are the film simulations. You can see the range there as well as the LUTs that are coming from LUTify.me. To add your own LUTs, click the Import button. Select LUTs from the list and click the Import button. Raw Power will process the LUTs and then add them to the list. And I can try them out immediately. If you want to see the LUTs that you've imported into the application, Click the My LUTs button. You'll see them right here. Now, if you make changes to the LUTs, make sure to quit and reopen Raw Power so that it can detect the change you've made to the LUT directory. As you can see, LUTs are a great way to quickly apply an effect to your images. Try the ones out that come with the app or add your own. Thanks for watching.